Hey guys, welcome back to the channel and to another music reaction. Today we're going to be checking out the latest, um, at least I think it's the latest at this point, um, we'll say one of the latest, most recent performances by Diana and Kudinova. Okay, so this is one that she actually put out for the holidays and I've just been like so behind on things that it's taking me a while to get caught up in my rotation. So, um, but yeah, she put this out for the holiday and this is a cover of What a Wonderful World, which I'm super curious to see how she actually is gonna perform this, what she's gonna do with it. Again, it's something very different from what I've typically seen her do, although you kind of get a feeling that that every single time it's something different. She just keeps adding in new stylistic choices. So yeah, I'm really interested to see what this is going to be like. A lot of you guys have been recommending it over the last couple of weeks, so I'm excited. Let's check it out together. Here we go. With Brandon Stone. The New Year cover. Okay, yeah, see this is already extremely different. <laughs> Ooh, she looks very pretty. I see trees of green, red roses too. I see them blue for me and you. And I think to myself, what a wonderful Skies of blue and clouds of white, the bright blessed day, the dark sacred night. And I love I this little snow myself. effect. This whole thing is very soothing. <laughs> what a wonderful. of the rainbow so pretty in the sky or else on the faces of people going by I see from chicken hands saying how do you do Cry. I watch them grow. They learn much more than I ever know. And I think to myself, what a wonderful. Tempo a bit, huh? Oh, okay. Got this. All right, I love this. This is awesome. Back down. Red roses too. I see them blue for me and you. And I think to myself, what a wonderful Wonderful 
That was lovely. That was very pretty. Ah, oh, all right. So that was, um, okay, with Branded Stone on piano. That was her cover of What a Wonderful World. And again, like I said, this is very different from things that I've seen from her previously. Um, but one way specifically that it stands out just as, as completely different from most of what I've seen from her is that this is like a, a staged music video. It's just her and, and a, a accompanist on the piano standing in front of a, a, a little stage and performing. Um, and re it's pre-recorded so that they can put the little snow effects over it and everything. But this isn't her performing in front of a huge audience in competition on a stage. So it's a very different sort of setting. It's much more like, I, I don't know how I would say maybe contained. It's more um, intimate, I'd say. It's a much more intimate sort of feel, um, which I think is also appropriate for this song in terms of comparing it to a lot of the other songs that she's done before. And it came out beautifully. I, I, you know, of course her voice is gorgeous and she did a great job with the song. We had the classic slow melodic parts of the song both at the beginning and then she brought it back to that at the end. Uh, but one thing that I was really enjoying about this particular performance of hers with this song is that she was going through her range quite a bit and pretty frequently she was going into kind of the higher ranges of her of her ability um or the higher octaves of her of her range i should say in a way that she doesn't quite as often she was doing that pretty frequently and it it sounded great and went where really well with the song but then of course she also got into the lower stuff a bit later as well so but again there was a very kind of like soothing tone to it i always talk about how to me her songs and watching her performances always always kind of hypnotize me it's kind of like trance like hypnotic and this is not a song that you would ever kind of think as being the song that could put you in a sort of trance like state but it still kind of carries over in a way because the way that she was able to perform this the kind of soothing nature of the beginning and then end part of the piece and her voice in particular being the one singing these lyrics, it was extremely soothing. It was very, it's like like being wrapped in a warm blanket and having hot cocoa. <laughs> um, it's all the like positive holiday feelings, right? Which is nice because it's a couple days after the holidays now at this point, you know, when you start to kind of get out of the holiday spirit and just back into things, but it's still winter and you're like, oh God, <laughs> now you're, you're done with winter now that holidays are over. But this, this, this brings back the feeling of it. It's still, you know, which is definitely a lovely and needed thing for everybody from time to time, I think. And then the part that I liked the most, that was my favorite, as you could probably tell if watching the reaction, was when they just, they upped the tempo a little bit and she was basically just, just riffing. Um, and then, and, and she just kind of added a little bounce, a little cheer to it for a little bit, um, which was, a, very unexpected and very fun and again it almost had like a like i'm sure it, it wasn't it was definitely planned out but it gave it like an improvisational feel which i think just adds to the sort of uh sort of idea of this as being more of an intimate sort of uh just one-on-one -on -one, just relaxing and being happy and enjoying yourself kind of performance that they're trying to portray here um as opposed to a lot of her other performances, which are in front of huge audiences on a massive stage. So again, it was a very sort of different performance from what I usually see from her, both in terms of the song choice, um, in terms of what her range and what she utilized here, and mainly very much in terms of the setting um, and the presentation. But as always, it was amazing. She did a fantastic job. I'm, I'm feeling really cheery. I want some hot chocolate. <laughs> Wrap my blanket around me and get cozy. And I'm not even that mad anymore that it's supposed to snow a lot here tonight. I was pretty mad about it, I'm not gonna lie, but this, this puts me back in a little bit of the cheery spirit, so. All right, guys. I'm going to wrap this one up here. As always, if you have other recommendations for me, please do leave them down in the comments below. Thank you so much for joining me, and hopefully I will see you next time. Bye.